like share and subscribe feel free to drop a comment if you like and i happily get back to you tiafimo lopez it looks like that he will be returning to boxing this mini retirement is over it was confirmed last night that tiafimo lopez will indeed keep his wbo title after the wbo president put some pressure on him to confirm whether he was going to relinquish the belt or not now let's track back a little bit here for those of you that might not be aware tiafimo lopez excellent performance in defeating josh taylor what was it, about a month ago now, I believe? Yeah, probably a, literally a month ago when he defeated Josh Taylor. Fantastic performance. I actually picked Josh Taylor to beat him, but Tiafimo Lopez went out there and put on a fantastic show, uh, really dominated Josh Taylor, and uh, looked back to his best, you know what I mean? Back to when he did beat Lomachenko. But what we do know is that Tiafimo Lopez is going through a bit outside of the ring. We know that he's currently going through a divorce. I'm not sure if that's all finalised yet, but I know that that was on his head. Um, and he's been pretty open about, you know, his mental health struggles. And it looked like when he announced his retirement after the Josh Taylor fight, that he was set, he was going to focus on his issues outside of the ring, clear his head and, and get back to it. But the WBO, after realising what Tiafima Lopez was saying, that he was going to retire, they put a 24-hour deadline on him to confirm whether he wanted to keep the belt or not. So it's all good talking. But the WBO wanted to really know if you were about it or not. And they put the pressure on him. And Tiafimo Lopez has come back and said that he will continue fighting. So he will keep the WBO belt and he will look to pursue fights at 140. One of those fights at 140 that he could be pursuing, Devin the Dream Haney. I'd love to see it. This would be a fantastic fight. Devin Haney, as we know, is the undisputed lightweight champion of the world. So that's the division below. However, it's looking like that he will move up at some point in the very near future. Discussions have been taking place for a fight between him and Regis Progray, who is also a belt holder at 140 pounds. Uh, there were talks about Devin Haney possibly taking on Shakur Stevenson. However, that is looking more unlikely now by the day. Um, it's looking like Devin Haney may entertain the move up. Tiafimo Lopez called out Devin Haney last night on social media, said that he wants to get that fight on. These two have been going at it on social media for quite a while now, even face to face. They've seen each other at boxing events. They've gone head to head. They've had their fair share of words. Uh, let's get this fight on, man. It's a brilliant fight. Devin Haney, undisputed lightweight champion at 135 pounds. Tiafimo Lopez with an impressive, very impressive performance over Josh Taylor. Um, let's get it on. I'd love to see it. And um, maybe it could be made. I mean, Tiafimo Lopez is not currently with anybody at the moment. Uh, Devin Haney, is he still in that top rank deal or is he a free agent now as well? Both of these guys could be free agents. So, Nothing really stopping them from getting this on. It could literally come down to the highest bidder as to who wants the rights to the fight. But I would love to see it, man. Uh, there are other options out there for both men. Regis Progray, the £140 division is very good right now. Uh, so let's see it, man. Let's see these fights happen. I don't know if, the, if Devin Haney is definitely giving up the belts at lightweight. Uh, there are some attractive fights to be made at lightweight. But how long can his body keep boiling himself down to make that weight limit, man? It's pretty clear that he wants to move up. So will he do it now or, or will he look to do it uh, in the near future maybe? Uh, time will tell, but yeah, these two were going at it on social media last night. I would love to see them get it on. How does that fight go if Tiafimo Lopez and Devin Haney were to fight? If they were to fight, if that was next, who would you be picking? Let me know in the comment section below, guys, and I'll catch you on the next video.